Hi and thank you so much for joining me. In this video we are going to talk about SEO on Wix. For a long time Wix had the reputation of not being able to rank on Google and therefore useless for uh, a lot of people in terms of where to put their website. But uh, they've made a strong effort to make SEO uh, important and you can rank on Google with uh, a Wix website, so let's check out their uh, how to do SEO with your Wix website. Now they do provide um, a guide that you can use to make it easy, so let's check that out and follow their guide. So the first thing is allow search engines to include your site in search results, so that's automatically done for you. And it says get found on Google. But let's check out a, a couple other things. Add header uh, code meta tags and show search engines that you're the site owner by adding header codes to the uh, head tag section of your site's code. Not going to do that right now. We're just going to check out this check checklist here. So let's uh, get found on Google. So Wix provides you with an SEO whiz. So let's get there. So it says, uh, what's your business name? So here is Drone8, which is just a fake name that I'm using for the uh, tutorials. Where's your I'm going to skip this. Where is it located? How would people search for you? Okay, so you can add five keywords. Separate these keywords by commas. I would put drone, a uh, cheap drone, budget drone, buy drone online. And let's see, white drone. There's just examples of maybe what my customers would type into Google if they were looking for my product. So it says analyze my keywords. Let's check that out and see what it does. It says, and it gives something called a keyword strength. Let's see what that is. Using stronger keywords can help more people find you on Google, but they don't really tell what, what strong means. So, and they give you some options for each set. They said we found keywords that could be even better for your site. Go ahead and choose up to five. So I've got the five. Get cheap drawn. So I'm gonna keep the ones I have. So let's create an SEO plan. So go to my plan. Site mobile friendly homepage is set to be visible in search. Yes. So update your homepage SEO title. Let's do that. The SEO page title or meta title is the first thing about you that people see on Google. Tell them who you are by adding your name, keywords, and location. You can edit this info from your page SEO settings. So what I need to do is choose one of these recommended titles and click copy. Buy drone online. So let's let's check out number two. So buy drone online. Let's copy that. Go to Wix editor, page menu, choose page, click on and page SEO paste text under what's the page title on search engines so go to editor all right let me check and see where they wanted to do that again go to wix editor pages menu choose a page okay so let's go here and let's do some SEO for the home page and click page SEO 
and what the page is about. And uh, let's see, it's right here. So buy drone online, drone eight. Then let's give it a description. Our that'll be our meta description. Best place to buy budget to buy. The hottest, most popular drones for for low prices. Done. All right. So we did that. So, change the homepage SEO description. I think we already did that. Optimize the homepage content. Go for it. Writing high quality original content is the most effective way to boost your SEO ranking. You can make your text Google friendly by adding your keywords and business or site name and including relevant information about what you do. So it's pretty straightforward. Basically, the content on your homepage. Make sure it's relevant to the title and and uh, meta red meta description. Now, the meta description is not a ranking factor in itself, it but it does uh, factor in if a person is going to click your listing on Google over someone else's if it's most relevant to the intent of why they're searching and what they're searching for. So keep that in mind. I hope that made sense. Update the contact info on the home page. Social links on the home page are not connected to your social pages. Of course, when you are doing your site, most of these things you will do automatically because you're going to include all the information possible. Now, this particular whiz, it, I would give it... Uh, I would say that it is a a good a good um, SEO checklist, basically. Very very good. I think if you do these, you will be doing what's needed uh, to rank on Google. There are a few more steps in the SEO process, like understanding competition and <laughs> keyword research and other things like that but for most people this will be uh, quite enough for you to um, do SEO for your site and like I said before uh, in the past Wix was considered not very good for SEO but now they're just fine for SEO so and this guide is really really good we can take a look at a few other things that are in the red here so and and it goes by page by page on what you need to fix. Like I said, update the contact page up uh, SEO title. And as you remember, you go to the page menu, which is right here. Your page menu. Click on it, and you just go to the page, and then you just put uh, click um, page SEO and the title now one tip for the SEO title is you might want to make sure that it's highly relevant to, for what the uh, page for but like your contact page is just going to be contact us or something like that so but um, and you can get put more information about that on there and here's what the uh, listing would look like on uh, Google if people saw it so for now I'm going to leave this tutorial right here uh, if you have any questions like uh, like always just leave them in the comments and I'll see you in the next video